we slam dunked the <laughs> shooting program so bad. It, it, it was unbelievable. I mean, we just absolutely put our foot down on all of our competition last year. It took two months before I was down, maybe even longer. It was, it was a higher high than what I received when I won my gold medal in 1984. Because it wasn't just me, it was 30 other people, plus the entire Marine Corps Wounded Warrior team and Marines as a whole. We just kicked butt. Out of 24 medals, Marines took 20 and probably should have had one more. Well, as, as we've told them, uh, guys, you got a huge bullseye on your back, but that's because you earned it and um, they're going to be coming after you. And that's the way it should be. And I don't think Marines are afraid of competition. I don't think Marines are afraid of challenges. And uh, our shooting is extremely disciplined. It is extremely precise. When you measure scores in tenths of a millimeter, it's, there's no room for error. So the demands of the sport are very high. The Marines but, from last year has raised the bar. And through this training process, they're shooting better. Uh, scores are definitely going to be higher than last year. Um, I think we'll do all right. And I, I ended up in the hospital after the trials, or after the games last year. And, and I was just totally spent, is what it basically was. And that's because I put it all into these guys. And uh, I'd do it again in a heartbeat. I am doing it again. But the thing about it is, is they're so worth it. This is, I, I can't put it into words, this is an incredible experience. Unlike any experience I've ever had in my life, there's nothing that I've done in 30 years, of, over 30 years of coaching that comes close to this. It's, it's, it's a class by itself, and I'm just honored to be a part of it. How do I put this in words? Oh, man. This was totally awesome. I, you know, I thought last, last year was an awesome achievement for the Marine Corps and for these young men and women. Uh, I never ever thought that we could do better, yet we did. It's just a joy to work with these young men and women and to help keep them from soaking into the woodwork through depression, drugs, and alcohol and the use of sport is keeping them busy, keeping them active, and keeping them going.